Hey everyone, we're going to solve the equation 2 sine squared of theta minus 3 sine theta plus 1 equals 0 on the interval 0 to 2 pi. So basically uh, this equation is a quadratic equation in sine theta and we can factor it. And the way you can think about this is that we have, um, if you let x equal sine of theta, then you'd have 2x squared minus 3x plus 1 equals 0. And this can be factored as 2x minus 1 times x uh, minus 1 equals 0. So that's your zero product, um, product property. And then we're going to do the same thing. So instead of x, you're just going to write sine. So you have 2 sine of theta minus 1 times sine theta minus 1 equals 0. Now uh, use your zero product product property and you get 2 sine of theta let's add 1 to both sides equals 1 divide both sides by 2 so sine of theta is 1 half. And then for this one uh, if you add 1 to both sides you get sine of theta equals 1. So we're looking for where sine of theta is one half. That means your y. Remember, sine is your y. So where is y one half? Here and here. So that means your angle, uh, your solutions are pi divided by 6 and 5 pi divided by 6. Now, where is sine of theta equal 1? So where is y 1? That's at pi divided by 2. So we already had these two. So the other solution, I'll just put it here, is pi divided by 2. And you therefore have three solutions. And that's it. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye. <laughs>